Okay, so it's just another little video just to go over the tubes because a lot of people have been asking questions is it related to the pressure of the tubes, etc. And I just want to do another little small experiment that you can do uh, just to figure out what kind of tubes you have. So here we have the plain plastic tubes and of course we have APRF tubes that have silica inside of them uh, or other types of chemicals. So very easy, if you want to figure things out, you can just pop the lids, okay? And you can hear the vacuum so you can hear it. Just actually add just a tiny little bit of water when you add water inside there, okay, then what you can do is just put the lid back on, shake it, and you can vigorously shake it if you'd like, okay, and you can actually see inside the tube, you know, there's nothing that's obviously coming coming off. Um, again, these are some of the APRF tubes that are from uh, 2020, so they're, they're relatively new. And again, the batch on these guys here is 18-10-GA, so it's more of the recent one. So we can open these. Okay, again, what we can do with these ones here, same thing. So you can pop the, you know, the seal off, you can hear it, and just put a little bit of water in there, okay? And, and then you can vigorously shake and figure out if there's anything off the wall. Okay, so if you look at that, take a look at that. Okay, that's when you can really see that there's obviously stuff that's coming off the wall. Um, and that's going into your patient, okay? Similarly, you can grab the other two from the same batch if you want, you know, I can just do a small little demo just to further illustrate this. If I shake this vigorously, right, again, look at what's being produced off the wall, okay? Uh, if I rinse this out, okay, I can go ahead and rinse this a few times and basically remove everything off the walls just to really clearly show that it's, you know, whatever additives are added inside some of these tubes. And that's why it's very important to make sure that you're using products that are within the FDA experience to class two medical device. So look at there, okay? Now, because everything's gone, look, if you don't see anything. If you let these sit for a little while, you'll see the bubbles will be removed. So if I grab all these three tubes here, I'll take a little bit out of this one here. And I'll just make sure, so this is the first one that I've removed it. There's the second one, and here's the white tube, okay? So again, I can shake these again. Okay, take a look at that. The difference is that's one that has not been cleaned out. Okay, so there's really a huge difference. Like I said, it's a very simple test you can do with whatever tubes you're buying just to figure out what's actually inside your tube. Okay? It's totally disgusting, like I said, what's coming out of these ones.